I, I assume you know how to load the data into Vecca. I have already loaded the data set. And now you go to select attribute. If you go to select attribute, there are two uh, selection bars available. One is the attribute evaluator, other one is the search method. Go to attribute evaluator, select principal components, and then say, yeah, you just click and click out so that's getting selected. Now you have a search method uh, by default it has to be a ranker so keep keep in, in the ranker. Once you go to principal components uh, click on principal components you will have two uh, parameters that needs to be set. One is the maximum attributes name that means the principal component analysis combines the input parameters and forms the minimal set of transformed features. In transformed features, you uh, how many untransformed feature you want it to be considered. So th that number is maximum attribute name. If you give five, it will consider five different uh, features, combine them together, form one feature and it will find the strength of that particular feature. Similarly, in the original data set that we have supplied right now, there will be some variance. How much of variance you wanted to retain? Let normally it will be 0.95, so I kept 0.95. You can say OK, and uh, uh, you are going to test it on the selection mode is on the full training set. You say start. Once you say start, it gives selected feature as 1, 2, 3, 4, whereas the feature 1, if you look at here, it represents minus 0 0.388 times range, minus 0 0.381 times standard error, minus 0 0.381 times standard deviation, minus 0 0.381 times maximum, and minus 0 0.35 times sample variance. Similarly, if you look at the second feature, so if you substitute range, standard, I mean the first feature you substitute range, standard error, standard deviation, maximum and sample variance, you compute this equation and finally you will get a value. That will be your first feature. Similarly, you compute the second feature, third feature, fourth feature. You can reduce uh, the 11, 12 features that we have uh, supplied to this algorithm, 12 features that will be reduced to these four features which will be more powerful which has the same variance, 95% of the variance that we have supplied is retained in this transformed data, this will be the transformed data. So use this feature 1, 2, 3, 4 as your new feature, which will have a different uh, a meaning, uh, but this will be useful for the uh, computation as it reduces the dimension of the data set.